Alright, what's happening y'all? BT back doing a video. It's been a minute. Well, not that long. Probably about early this week, but thought I'd go ahead and do one today. Um, biggest news, of course. Um, it's been NBA talk all day long. Today is draft day. We've had a few trades that will shake up the draft a little bit, so um, the big storyline that everybody's fussing and anxious about is Shaq is in Cleveland. Of course, you know, everybody doesn't always forget he's there, but he has to, of course, they have to make sure all the physicals are squared away, meaning that Ben Wallace's physical is straight, Sasha Pavlovich's physical is straight, um, and of course, the Shaq is all right, you know, to play it also. We can't, nobody should get their hopes up too high just yet, but it's in the works, and it looks like the trade will probably go down. Um, I got a lot of text and a lot of information surrounding the trade involving Richard Jefferson to San Antonio. Um, it makes the team younger, but the team is still an old team. I mean, you still got veterans who are on that team that can't do the things that they used to do. Michael Finley is not the same guy. Um, Roger Mason is a is a big asset to the team. Don't get me wrong. It's just a lot of things that you got to take time and look at and understand in a trade. So, just, you know, that's just something that I was sitting down looking at and realizing with the um, with the trades before the draft. The draft is tonight. Starts at 7.30, of course. Though you, you true NBA fans already know it's going to be on ESPN. Um, it'll start. They'll do like the pre-draft ceremony at, or the pre-draft storyline at 7.30. Then at 8 o'clock is when the draft actually starts. Stacked with a lot of guards. You got a pretty fair share of talent, a uh, good cream of the crop. But the biggest thing that they've been saying or the biggest thing that I've mostly caught on to is, okay, you look at the draft, you see Blake Griffin, you see to be Rubio. You got a few names that are some marquee players, but the question is, will they have breakout, you know, will they have good careers or good enough, you know, performance in the league to make a mark and show that they should be playing? Always check me out over here. Sorry, I always love doing it. It's kind of fun, just something to mess around with you on. Um, and speaking of that, um, three of my profiles that I have right now are through, on, you know, the three links that I have are, of course, Twitter, MySpace, and Facebook. And I'm going to ask this question real quick. I mean, shockingly, I only did the NBA story in, like, less than three minutes, but since I got a little bit of time to kill, how many of you have accounts or other profiles or, I'm sorry, have accounts or other profiles or other sites, but you don't let everybody know about all of your sites. Me, of course, everybody knows the big three. Um, everybody knows about the blog, so it's kind of like nothing to hide, nothing to lose. But some of your friends that you have on one site, you may not have them on another site because you're hiding or you might just don't want them on that site to begin with because you got more, you got yourself more in the wide, I guess. I don't know. It's, it's a a, a murky thought, but it's just something that I think about a few times. Um, I've had a few of my friends, we've gone, well, I ain't gonna say back and forth, but I've had a few of my friends that I've conversed with about, you know, yeah, I get on Twitter, and they're like, well, I'm not getting on Twitter, and I don't like Twitter. And I'm like, you know, I say it like this you have your choice of where to make or meet people. Um, it's more so, I think the only reason I'm into it as much as I am is because it's beyond just going online and talking to people you know and saying what's up you kind of get a chance to meet new folks that you may never come across anytime soon but you get to have a good time you know chatting with them and stuff like that so I just want to get into that real quick this might be one of my short videos but hey it happens anyways check out the draft hope your team gets who they're trying to get for the last time anybody who wants to know who my favorite team is I don't have a team I like the NBA um, too many players go too many places and too much transactions and trades go down for me to even stick with one player. So that breaks that down. Sorry for the gleam and the glamour of the, of the light in my face, but you know how I do. Anyways, y'all take it easy. Be safe. I'm out.